good morning oh oh my phone's gone funny good morning guys um so today we are heading to yorkshire for our weekend away just excuse all this mess like i don't know i just haven't really had the time to clean <laughs> um but we've packed well kind of i'm just putting all my last bits and bobs that i've used like my straightener and stuff this morning my makeup stuff um i'm vlogging on my normal phone today just because it's easier and my vlogging camera um is not charged so i say camera because it's just my other phone um but yeah i'm really disappointed in the weather i woke up and it was really really sunny let me go into the other room and i'll show you outside but it was really really sunny when i first woke up and the blinds aren't open in here i swear oh tom must have closed them because i opened them this morning it's not it doesn't look too bad it does look blue skies, but it, it's dull blue skies. It's not it's not like sunny um, like it was this morning. I'm just going to close these again. I think it's because we're trying to create the illusion that we're still home and we're not just so we don't have to ask the neighbours to come and check on the house. Um, so I'm going to get ready um, to go and I'm going to head off. Everything's packed, everything's ready. I know I didn't really vlog much this morning. Uh, that is because I just wanted to get everything ready. So then we could just kind of get get there and get off and check in and everything. So let's do this. Hey guys. So we're just getting in the car. Tom's over there with the bags. Um. Yeah, so everything's packed and ready. We're just packing up the car right now. And uh, camera's being really white and gay again. Um. The outfit I'm wearing is like this long dress, which it looks quite short, but it actually goes all the way down to like below my knees with this like leather jacket. I don't know why it's so bright. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, we're just gonna have to leave it. Yeah, so I'm gonna basically film and vlog. Um, I'm so excited. I really am. I mean, I don't feel the best, but my excitement is like overweighing that at the moment. Like, I haven't been on holiday or gone anywhere in ages, so yeah. So we're here, that's our hotel right there, I don't know if it will focus or not. And Tom's just gone to see if the rooms, oh my gosh, my camera is being so annoying. This is why I never vlog on this one. Um, yeah, so Tom's just gone to go check if our room's ready and if it is, I'm gonna go up and take our bags up and everything, just unpack a few things. But the weather has turned out so nice, I don't know if you can see. The, the sky is cleared up, especially in Yorkshire anyway, it's sunny, I'm, I mean it's not hot, but it's warm. And I'm just so excited. I feel like summer as well. I'm wearing like more of like a summer dress as well. So yeah, I'm super excited. Eee. Can I have breakfast to go? Can I have what? Breakfast to go. Oh sorry. Um so we're at the we're in the room. Um I was gonna vlog like the whole the like the um, the thing, the hallway thing, but it's really like dark and gloomy, so I didn't <laughs> um uh, I don't know. Let me give you. Uh, let me give you guys a tour. So let me flip the camera. Okay, so this is like the doorway here. Hang on, it's not focusing. And then right next to the doorway is the bathroom. Oh my gosh, it's still not focusing. Why? Okay, there we go. Um, you got like the sink area. Tom, what's this thing? It's like a thing. Um, yeah, and there's the bath. I'm not going to show you the toilet. And there's like a shower. There is a bath. Um, and then I'm sorry if you can hear me chewing, chewing gum. And then you've got the bed, got a television on the wall, and then just like a little seating area. And like a little tea making area here, which is really cool. Um, so we just realised that we actually didn't realise that you had to book tea. Um, what time did you book it for? Uh, what time did you book tea for? Uh, half seven. Yeah, so we booked it for half seven. I couldn't remember what time. Um, 
which we didn't actually realize that you had to do in the first place which is kind of annoying because we're planning on going down to the pool but now we're gonna have to do that first because the pool closes at eight o'clock is it yeah. yeah so the pool the pool closes at eight um so we're gonna go down i think we're just gonna get changed or whatever now and probably go down to the pool like quite now and then because then we have time to come back and relax and stuff and get changed and if i do get my hair wet then we'll have to re-straighten it so and thyme roasted flat mushrooms with herb. Fuck me, you can read it. It's too posh for me. Hey guys, so we just went down to the pool um, a little while ago. Um, hence why I've got no makeup on and my skin is so bad right now. I just used, um, I'm, one, I'm allergic to chlorine. Like you can see my chest, it's like so red. And two, the makeup wipes I bought yesterday, I'm also allergic to. So that's also why my face is super red. But ignore the rash and ignore my face. Um, I was gonna show you guys the pool, but you couldn't take cameras in there. Um, I had like a massive rule list and the guy was like, read these li rules before you go in and everything. Um, and I got in there and there's like loads of people walking around with their bloody phones, so I could have. I guess it's cause it's like the whole pedo situation and everything. Um, but yeah, so basically I'm just going to dry my hair um, and yeah, basically get ready for tea, I'm probably going to have to redo my makeup. Also I didn't bring any ID because me and Tom were going to go down to the bar and see if we could get a drink but I'm worried that I might not get served. But I said to them, um, <laughs> I always say this, let me just balance you here for a sec. I always say this but I say like, if they don't serve me, I'm going to show them my medical ID because it's got, I know it's not probably not going to focus. But it's got my date of birth, also that was when I cut myself shaving, that little cut there. But yeah, it's got my medical ID and it has my birthday on there. Like, why would I wear a fake birthday on my actual medical ID, which can save my life, so... Yeah, so I'm just gonna life. But usually I don't, I don't get asked. But the one time I probably don't have ID, they'll probably ask me, so yeah. So I've just got a cup of tea, I'm gonna dry my hair and do my makeup. And I will, guess I'll update you guys a bit, in a bit. Um, as you can see, me and Tom have already made a mess of the room completely, so... Bye bye! So I don't know if I um, updated after I did my uh, hair and makeup, but um, we haven't actually gone out for tea yet. Um, we're just are we going to Asda first. I don't know. We we were going to Asda either before or after. We haven't decided yet. Just to get some stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm just about to straighten these little bits of my hair here because they've gone all kinky because I've just been lying down in bed. I'm wearing this. It's like a um like a lace top, it like it kind of looks like it's my bra there, but it actually has like a little like black top, I don't know if you can see it underneath this, like it's attached to it. I'm just wearing that with leggings and some, uh, that's a terrible angle, let me show you. And some heel shoes and um, like that. And Tom has just got on like a black top and blazer and he's wearing his, what do you call this, suede? Desert shoes. Desert shoes, um, so yeah. First time trying creme brulee. You gotta tap it. I'm not gonna stay outside. Oh my god, it's getting there. I thought it would be um, more, I don't know.
<laughs> what is it? Hey guys. Um, so, is that the bath running? I'm just vlogging. Is that the bath running? It's so loud. Close the door. So, Tom was just running me a bath. That literally did nothing, but oh well. Um, we got back from dinner. It was pretty um, disappointing, actually. I had some croquettes, which for those of you who don't know they are, they're like these little potato things, but they were corned beef croquettes and they were literally tasted of nothing. There was no flavour whatsoever. It was kind of, yeah. Um, the best thing about it was the creme brulee, which Tom had. Um, I'll probably, probably just insert that clip um, before, I think. So you might have already watched it. But um, creme brulee was good. Like, I, I've never tried creme brulee before, but it was really creamy and delicious. I don't know if that was an average creme brulee, so I don't know what it tastes like to a normal one, but it was so good. Stomach is killing me so bad now. I've just taken some meds, so hopefully that calms it down a bit. Um, obviously, for those of you who know, I have trouble digesting food, if not at all, and I end up throwing it up. I apologise for the noise. Um, but yeah, so because of the chlorine before, my skin's gone all rashy and horrible, so I'm having a bath to try and soothe it a bit. Um, and then apart from that, we're just going to chill, I think. We've got some stuff planned for tomorrow. We're going to this outdoor art gallery museum thing, so that should be fun. Um... But yeah, that's pretty much it for today, so I'm probably going to end today here, or I might carry on, end today here, but carry on vlogging, like, depends how much vlogging material I've done today, I can't really remember what I filmed or what I haven't, because I've got two different phones, I've got this phone and my other phone that I vlog on, so I've got two different sets of, like, footage, so <coughs> I'll have to say, um, what I've got, um, and how long this vlog actually is, but if it ends here, then I love you guys so much. Um, and please subscribe to this channel. I'll leave all my links down below. And good night. And if I carry on, then I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Um, I woke up about a couple minutes ago. My alarm went off. Um, so pretty well. Um, so I'm not gonna do a really long introduction. Tom's just packing away some of the stuff, so it's easier. So we don't have to rush out of the room later. Um, but yeah, and then we're gonna go down for breakfast, so I'm just gonna do my makeup. I just took my meds and everything, so let's get ready. So I'm all ready. Um, I'm about to go get some breakfast. I woke up with this pain like around here, and it keeps getting worse, and I really don't know what it is, so let's hope it doesn't get too bad. It kind of feels like to my kidneys, because I've had like a kidney infection, so I don't know. Are you ready mm -hmm. to get some breakfast? I'm gonna tie. I know I'm tired too. We we both woke up this morning, um, like before our alarms, and we kept. Ca Did you wake up in intervals or just the ones? Oh, I kept waking up like from eight to nine, like every like, couple minutes, not a couple minutes, like every like 10, 15 minutes. So it was really frustrating. But um, yeah. So I'm pretty tired. Plus we kind of well, Tom didn't get to sleep till like per, like three o'clock. Um. I did sleep for like maybe an hour, um, and then I woke up. With the, like when he got up to go to the toilet, I woke up, and then we like sat up chatting for ages. So I'm pretty tired, but you know, I feel tired anyway normally. So just get on with it. Um, we're going to see some art sculpture things today outside. That's assuming that the weather isn't too bad though. But we got raincoats. <laughs> Tom was forcing me to bring my raincoat. Where have you put it now? I don't. I'll show you it. I like it, but I don't like. I think people judge you and like think you're a chav if you wear stuff like this. So, oh, there's money in it. Um, it's just like a Nike one, and it's like half white, half black. Um, so I've got that in case it rains, which I'll show you outside right now. It looks pretty cloudy. So yeah, we packed up most of our stuff. So when we get back to the room after breakfast, we don't have to do much. Just kind of shove my extra bits and bobs like these things back in the case. So. Yeah, let's go. Hey guys. <laughs> Oh, it's quite windy out. Maybe the winds come back. I was literally saying yesterday that the wind was gone because we had Storm Doris pass by, but Doris. I don't know if you can see them. Trees wiggling around. Right, so the funniest thing happened last night. You know how I said Tom woke up at like 3 a.m.? Well, he hadn't slept yet. 
I, did you sleep a bit or not? Were you asleep when you had your epiphany? Like, did you wake up or was it just like, you were already awake? No, I was already awake, I was on Pots UK. Oh. <laughs> so basically, Tom was on the Pots UK website. For those of you who don't know Pots is, it's postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome, and I'll leave a link below. I've got a link to most of my health um, problems down below, so you guys can go check more information. Basically, when I woke up, he was like, I know how to cure POTS, I've had an epiphany, or whatever. And basically, there's this thing called serotonium. What is it, a hormone or something? A chemical? Yeah. Chemical? I don't know. So basically, like a chemical in your body, and people in POTS... I haven't researched it that much. <laughs> well, anyway, people with POTS don't have enough of it. It helps your brain send signals through your central nervous system. Oh. Your heart rate oh, so it's like the, the whole dysautonomia thing then? Yeah. Oh, so it's like everything, not just parts? Yeah. So basically, if you can get more of this chemical or whatever it is, then it's going to help regulate your whole nervous system. So that includes, I don't know if it includes EDS and GP and stuff like that. I don't think it can include that, man. But <laughs> all the dysautonomia kind of, I don't know, symptoms, I guess. But we're gonna, the antidepressants that have the serotonium in it, and you can also get supplements that have serotonium in it. So, for those of you who are interested, I'm gonna try and link some information down below. This, most of this information was actually found off the POTS UK website, so, and I'm pretty sure I already have that link down below anyway. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna go to the doctors probably next week and see if we can either go on an antidepressant or the supplements to try and help. Um, and if it works, then I'll let you guys know. Guys, this morning I said the Storm Doris, well actually no, yesterday I said the Storm Doris was like gone or over or whatever. It's actually almost as bad as when we were coming back from London. The wind is super bad, like, in fact I'll turn my music down, you might be able to hear how actually windy it is. I'll flip the camera so you can see. Like Tom's going to have both hands on the wheel to try and keep it from like shifting into the lanes because when we were coming down from London the wind was like head on so it was basically you just had to kind of accelerate more and like go forward more to keep going but now the wind's like on the side so it's kind of blowing us across the lanes which is like dangerous and the wind on when did we come that was a tuesday okay. the wind on tuesday was i think it was like 70 or 80 miles no i don't think it was 80 it's like 60 or 70 miles per hour and that was like super strong it's not as bad it's about 50 now um, but the roads have been super close to being closed then, so we're lucky that they're not closed now. But it's really dangerous, and, and like this, like big caution sign saying like slow down and stuff. So everyone's like driving slower. Let's hope we get there safe. Um, yeah, so we stopped. We went to the sculpture park, but it was super windy and freezing, and I wasn't feeling very well. So we kind of left that a bit early. But now we're on our way to Trafford. And I really want to get some of the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. Everyone's like raving about it. Well, I say everyone. Like, just a couple people I know that have tried it said, like, you have to try it. And I did a... I did a, like, yesterday, I put a first impressions video up um, of the Urban Decay All Night foundation. So I think I'm going to get this. I'm going to test this out and do another first impressions. So let me know. Go and watch that video. I'll link it down below. And let me know if you enjoy that, because then I can do another one. So, yeah. Um, so we're home now. Um... It's been a long day, it's been pretty tiring. I had so much fun, um, it was a really, really good time. Even though it was like a short trip, it's hard because I've got like a lot of illnesses and stuff that prevent me from staying certain places for a long time because of obviously medical stuff and all that stuff. So if you guys enjoyed this vlog, I know it was kind of long, um, but I really wanted to get like the whole like two days worth of stuff in there um, rather than 
do like, a couple of separate vlogs. So I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe and all my links will be down below. And hopefully stuff that I've mentioned throughout the vlog, I've actually linked. So if I have, it will be down below. But you guys know what I'm like. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye.